Hello again, YouTubers. As I begin to make videos about national days that don't have a specific date, I can't think of a better day to start with than National Ice Cream Day, which falls on the third Sunday of July. <sighs> Ice cream. A delicious frozen treat that is loved by millions, if not billions, of people anywhere, anytime, and any place. Now, while many of us are familiar with ice cream in its many forms, flavors, and even brand names, a lot of us aren't aware that this rich dish has a rich history. Let's just go down the list. <clears throat> we start our journey over 4,000 years ago in China. Milk was considered a valuable product, and a favorite dish of the upper class was something called milk ice, which was a paste comprising of milk, overcooked rice, and spices, which is then packed in snow so it could harden. Then, as time goes by, and the Chinese became more proficient in making frozen foods, by the 13th century, utilizing fruit juices, they also developed the fruit ice. Then, in the 14th century, the milk and fruit ices appeared in Italy, with credits split between Marco Polo and Tuscan confectioner Bernardo Guantelante. But, but even back then, the dishes were still accessible only to the wealthy. Then we moved from Italy to France, where the Venetian Catherine de' Medici used fruit ices to establish the culinary worldliness of her country. It was in France where she also introduced a semi-frozen concoction made from a thick sweetened cream more similar to modern day ice cream. Then we fast forward to the 1560s, where ice cream became freezable in larger proportions. Then, soon enough, a few centuries later, throughout Europe, Italian immigrants sold ice creams and ices in little carts on the street, finally making the dishes within reach of the masses. And, and the history goes on from there. Thomas Jefferson brought the recipe of ice cream from France to Philadelphia, which made possible the introduction of the ice cream soda in 1874, and Harry Bird of Youngstown, Ohio advertised the first chocolate-covered vanilla ice cream bar, as well as put the first ice cream trucks on the streets, etc, etc, etc. So now, thanks to the Chinese, the Italians, and the French, we now have this amazing, life-changing dessert that can put a smile on anyone's face. So you go on out, pick out your favorite flavor, and dig right in. Either with friends, with family, or by yourself. I won't tell anyone. <laughs> From me to you, Happy National Ice Cream Day!